Hello everyone, in today's video, you will learn in 8 quick steps how to optimize performance, get more FPS, and fix FPS drops and stutter in Valorant on your low-end PC. In the first step, you are going to disable the full screen optimizations in Valorant, because this feature can cause performance issues in some computers. First, open the Valorant installation folder, and you can find out the Valorant installation path in the game settings in the Riot client. After that, navigate to Shooter Game, Binaries, and Win64. Now, right-click on the Valorant Win64 shipping e-file and then click on the Properties. After that, select the Compatibility tab and then check the to Disable Full Screen Optimizations option. And lastly, click on Apply and OK to save the change. In the second step, I'll show you how you can optimize your memory, graphics card, and CPU performance using registry files and the MSI Utility Program. Open the registry file, click yes, and OK, in the pop-up message. We need to check the processor model. I have an AMD, so I will open the registry file in the AMD folder. Open the registry file to increase the priority of the game. Clear the cache and temporary files. We need to check the RAM of the system. I have 32 GB, so I choose the 32 GB RAM registry file. Run programs to optimize memory. Run the MSI Utility Program to optimize the video card, this is very important for a smooth game. Set the settings like mine. In the third step, I will show you three options that you can enable in Windows to prevent your system from limiting your computer's performance, making you get the maximum possible performance in Valorant. First, search for the game mode in the start menu and then click on game mode settings. After that, make sure that the game mode is enabled, otherwise enable it. Then, just select this section called graphics. In this search this list of field, type Valorant. After that, click on Valorant and then click on options. Now, select the High Performance option and then click on a Save. After that, press the keys of Windows and a R on your desktop. In the Open a field, type PowerCV.CPL and then click on OK. And lastly, simply select either the Windows High Performance Power Plan or the CPU High Performance Power Plan if available. In the fourth step, you're going to prevent Windows apps from running in background to ensure that these apps don't slow down your computer and worsen performance in Valorant. First, press Windows and R on the desktop. In the e Open field, type Epedit MSC and then click on OK. After that, navigate to e-Computer Configuration, Administrative Templates, Windows Components, and then App Privacy. Now, double-click on Let Windows Apps Run in the Background. Then select the Enabled option in the left upper corner. After that, under Default for all apps, select a Force Deny. Lastly, click on Apply and OK to save the change. In the fifth step, you're going to learn some performance settings on NVIDIA Control Panel. And these settings can increase FPS and performance in Valorant. First, right-click on Desktop, click on Show More Options, and then NVIDIA Control Panel. After that, select the Manage 3D Settings section. Now, under Ambient Occlusion, select Off. In Anisotropic Filtering, select Off. In Anti-Aliasing Mode, select Off. Now scroll down and under Low Latency Mode, select Ultra. In Multi-Frame Sampled AA, I select Off. In Power Management Mode, select prefer maximum performance in preferred refresh rate select highest available in shader cache size select unlimited in texture filtering quality select performance in triple buffering select off in vertical sync select off and lastly click on apply to save all the changes in the sixth step you will lower the resolution quality in valorant to increase fps while leaving the game blurry 
First, press Windows and R on the desktop. In the open a field, type percent local app data percent Valorant, and then click on OK. Now navigate to a saved, config, then a folder with some letters and numbers in its name, and lastly the Windows folder. After that, right-click on the game user settings file, select the open with, and then choose another app. Now, select a notepad, and then click on hallways. After that, scroll down until you find the scalability groups section. Then, under resolution quality, type 75. And lastly, click on file and a save to save the change. In the seventh step, I will show you the best graphics settings in Valorant for low-end PC. First, open Valorant. Now, click on this gear in the upper right corner and then click on a settings. After that, select the general tab. Now, scroll down and under show corpses, show blood, and show bullet tracers, select off. After that, select the video e tab. Under a display mode, select a full screen and then click on apply. After that, select the graphics quality tab. Under multi-threaded rendering, select on. And lastly, in all these remaining options, select low and off. Well, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I'm sure you've increased your FPS to the skies. Have a great game and good luck.